please, please, for the love of God, do not buy Black Ops 3 for PC. Like, I know it seems glamorous and it seems, you know, cool and everything because Treyarch is back in business making new games, or at least Call of Duty games, but it's not as cool as it seems. Like, you are wasting money, tons and tons of money. Like, probably around $40. Maybe more if you are stupid enough to buy more things in the season pass. I don't know how that's possible, but oh no, it is because of the camo. So at least that was an advanced warfare. Now, only reason why I'm making this or even saying this is because I wish, oh, I wish I had someone to tell me, hey, don't be stupid and buy Call of, the next Call of Duty with with the season pass on PC. Like, don't get me wrong, like, I'm not a console fanboy or anything like that. It's specifically because the number one reason there is no one on the servers, like, not a single person. You will be never, ever, 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 ever playing the DLCs. And this is not just for Black Ops 3, I know it's going to happen on, it happened on Advanced Warfare, it happened on Ghost, and it happens on like every single call of duty that's on pc I, I honestly have no idea why maybe it's because no one buys it I, I don't think that's the answer but somehow there's never anyone on any server if you have the season pass to get around that you have to uninstall all of the dlc you purchased because no one else will be able to play it with you that's kind of messed up kind of i guess they're jipping you making you waste like 40 bucks now yeah you can get around that you can uninstall it at least that's what i did to even play it for like 20 minutes was to install all of my dlc that i paid for so i can play with people who didn't have it which still was barely enough only about three servers were avail were available for for only team deathmatch it wasn't even for domination or any other map even with the dlc cut off so i don't know my prediction is that the same exact thing is going to happen in Black Ops 3. I could be wrong, I could be dead wrong, and it's really popular and you'll never have trouble finding a server, but it's unlikely, doubt it, and I really, really don't want anyone else to waste their money. I know I'm not going to waste my money, I'm not going to buy it, I'm not going to even buy the regular version, because I don't even want to risk that because months down the line of Black Ops 3 coming up, yes, there'll be people on zombies because who doesn't love zombies, but no one's going to be on multiplayer at all. Yeah, you still get the single player, you get zombies, but for, I guess, the core reason why people even buy Call of Duty, you won't get to enjoy yourself, at least not on PC. And it's strange because on console, you join a server like less than a second on any single game mode you want. Because there's so many people playing it. But apparently, <laughs> on PC, that doesn't exist. It doesn't happen. I don't know why, but like I said, my guess is that no one plays it or no one bought it. Or at least, literally no one, or not literally, but a lot of people did not buy the season pass for Advanced Warfare. And there was no one to play with. Not a single server on any single game mode. So... Yeah, that's about it. Uh, <laughs> I'm just, I'm mad that I wasted 40 bucks. And I hope you don't do the same in Black Ops 3. And I hope you don't buy it at all.